All right, well, a very interesting story now about using artificial intelligence to help detect breast cancer. A new study found AI performed on par with human doctors when it came to interpreting breast cancer screenings. The AI was able to detect more cancer while keeping false positives to a minimum, which of course is great news. In most countries, breast cancer is one of the top two leading causes of cancer deaths in women. But early detection can save lives, so AI being pitched as a way to increase screening capacity. Some experts, though, are warning the technology still needs to be refined to ensure it doesn't overdiagnose or miss the cancer. Joining us now is Martin Yaffe, leading breast cancer and imaging scientist, joining us at Sunnybrook Health Sciences Centre that's in Toronto. Martin, thanks for taking the time for us today. Appreciate you coming on CTV News. Your thoughts on AI to detect breast cancer? Well, I think AI has a number of different roles in uh, detection of breast cancer. And the recent study that you were referring to uh, used it as a second reader, something that's widely done in Europe, but not so much in North America because of the cost and the lack of ab availability of uh, skilled radiologists uh, to interpret the images. But when you have two radiologists look at the, at the images, it's more likely the breast cancer will be detected accurately. And in this study that was done in uh, Sweden, uh, they used AI uh, as a second reader so they had one human reader looking at the mammograms, but uh, AI served as, as that second reader. And they found that the performance was extremely similar to that of having two human readers. As well, the idea that, you know, the reliability of AI, any concerns there about, you know, this is a relatively new technology being able to properly detect or not detect breast cancer. What do you think, Martin? Well, the, the final decision is always made by the radiologist. So you should think of the AI as, as an assistant, as a tool which uh, advises the radiologist and gives them additional uh, information, uh, but then they'll make the ultimate judgment. So I don't think there's really much of a risk unless the radiologist is overly reliant on the AI, which they shouldn't be. There's not much of a risk of making an error, but this technology will, I think, improve efficiency and it'll allow that double reading to be done. And I hope it's done in the future in uh, here in Canada, where I think it will improve accuracy of breast cancer detection. Yeah, and also to increase screening capacity, right? So that you, you don't necessarily have people who are waiting or things that are missed or just, you know, lack of, of staffing, lack of manpower. Absolutely. Think of small communities in this country where we just don't have enough people and uh, the computer algorithm could be put in anywhere. So I think it will really will improve efficiency. It'll also reduce costs because you don't have to be paying human readers to, to double read each of these examinations. Martin Yaffe joining us from Toronto. He's a leading breast cancer scientist. Thanks so much for this, Martin. Good to see you. Much appreciated. My pleasure. Thank you.